All right, this is Calibos, and we are playing uh, Skybees. Uh, so in the last episode, I kind of hinted that we were kind of doing a little something a little bit more complicated with our, our botany pot than just kind of like a randomly shoving it somewhere. So we're going to do that now. Uh, and it involves having dirt. So many things in Minecraft involve having dirt. So these aren't necessarily going to stay here. Oh, there's a... What are you? Cobblestone bee. Hmm. Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to take some of these ancient spores and we're going to do this and then we're going to grab another water barrel or make one, you know. And we're going to put it here. And because I have an extra barrel and I can, I'm going to put it there. Then. We're going to do this. And we're going to watch this. Hopefully begin to transform. No idea if it needs to be like on the same level or whatever. It usually just had to be near it before. Okay, which water? Um. So mycelium, yeah, I think it just needs to be nearby. It needs to be on top. Yeah, it needs to be like directly on top. Hi, cobblestone bee. My ongoing plan here to uh, do that. So that's which water. Do we have a quest for which water? Oh, it wants a stone barrel for that. Ooh, picky, picky, picky. Uh, and then it wants a buzzing doll. But that is okay. So for us, we're actually going to want to grab a couple of these. Don't ask me why I'm not just using the builder's wand. I don't know. That bee was green. I wonder if that is a healthy color for bees. Ta da! Wait, 
Should that not have given me a nether quartz? Um. Oh, I needed a flint mesh. I knew that. Totally knew that. And foot mesh. Easy. All right, now when we sieve this, it should give us two, which is perfect. That is exactly what we needed. Let's go grab some redstone. How about a grand total of six? Like we're actually going to need a couple more of those. You know what? Uh, we're just going to need a lot of these anyway, so. Okay, stone barrel. So that completes down to here. Uh, we're going to need a couple more of you. So for the slave... So we'll need one gold ingot. Toss that in there. Let's uh, check on our It gives us the gold ingot. It gives us the that. We'll need a drawer. Uh, you know what we'll do? I never use them, but this will set us up for the quest. gives us a drawer controller slave. So now we still need a primary drawer controller. Uh, which is going to be exactly the same thing. Uh, except it's going to be diamond instead of...
gives us two. We'll need a couple more uh, redstone. Grab our diamond. Drawer controller. So uh, that goes ahead and our storage drawers quest here is done. Here's done in a little bit. We'll have keys. We just need to do these and we'll be finished with this quest. So looking into our trim here. So we need to go up from right here. Uh, so that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Now we need to go down one. Okay, let's put a torch up here really quick. Okay, so what we have done is now all of this should be activated by that controller. So if I have a location for Leaves, apples, sticks, and saplings. Um, then I put this slave down pretty much anywhere. Here, let's try not to get struck by lightning. It seems like a bad choice. So we're going to look at our numbers here. So uh, we're also going to need a location for wood. Let's go get some wood. I don't know, this seems fine. So I'll put this down and we're gonna toss this on top of it and need the dirt. And then we're gonna need a tree. So that's going to take a minute, but it is now automatic. We'll probably have more going. I wish it would be faster. I don't know if there's... Um, if different soils have different speeds. Growth modifier... Let's look for oak saplings and see what the 
what the best is for oak saplings. There it is. So infused grass. Wait, 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 wait. Dry grass is bad. Crimson nylium is okay. So farmland is minus 15. So it'll drop 18 seconds off our time. Enchanted soil from Batania is 30 seconds off. Okay, so we'll have to figure out how to make that. Uh, meanwhile, that takes ridiculous amounts of time. Okay, sure. I don't necessarily know that I'm going to rely on that because, I mean, it's fine if we're not using a lot of it, but we'll be using a lot of it. But... Uh, because of the slave controller, it is going to be automatically dropping all of that stuff in here. Okay, so it's not the best tree farm, but it is kind of automatic. So what we'll do is we'll, we'll leave it doing its thing for the moment. And we're going to set up this part. So I'll need two redstone. I think we can get rid of those. are on the same one. Ok, 
need more iron. Uh, second there, I could not move right. Wow, so many. Things in my inventory at this point. Uh, nickel, osmium. I guess I could make a dump chest. Bauxite. I have no idea why I'm carrying this stone barrel around. Let's put it down. Gives us the osmium. Tin redstone. Sides. Okay, so um, let's get rid of this. Let's eat this apple. We're going to start needing uh, still more iron, actually.
yeah, this is pretty much descended into I am harvesting rocks. Um, it does give us enough to begin smelting some more iron, though. And we do need more iron so that I can make another hopper for uh, for that. We want to do that. We want to get rid of that. Throw this down again. Look at us. We're starting to have our very own automation. Oh, hop it's in the wrong spot. I knew that. I've done this a million times. Okay. So now that is going to slowly feed all of the stuff into the flower. We are going to keep harvesting more iron. Um, so we've, we've got steps out of the process for us. You know, at least steps that we don't have to personally mind. So our next trick here is going to be getting getting power and machinery because I'd really like to get into mechanism to make our our mana stretch further because if we can double or triple our ore then the orchid is is cool. Uh, another thing that we'd like to be able to do is automate smooth stone production so that we can um, so that we can just place it and break it rather than needing needing to do that ourselves but this is a good place to leave it so i hope you enjoyed the episode if you did leave me a like if you didn't don't questions comments concerns they're all fantastic things i'd love to hear them I definitely need advice, um, so just go ahead and leave that below too. And if you like the episode, you know, leave me a like, etc. I think I've said all that. Uh, what can I say? I'm tired. But uh, have a good night.